Hi everybody, I'm TJ Miller. And I'm Eddie Rothenberger. Welcome to Action Reality Martial Arts Principle of the Week of Chivalry! In honor of the New Jersey Renaissance Fair, which is opening in two weeks, which means we are going crazy. Uh, remember, if you like this video, uh, please subscribe to our channel for more great workouts and martial arts tips. And also like the video, if you like it. Uh, we are up to our next new Renaissance Fair stuff, but I realized we didn't give you guys a video this week. So I wanted to come in here today before class and do something for you guys. So check it out. Okay guys, today we're going to be working on what we call a split entry. Uh, when Emmy's throwing a punch at me, uh, there's basically the outside zone, the inside zone. So I'm going to uh, block and strike at the same time, and I'm going to have one hand on each of those zones. So when she punches, I'm going to parry and be on the outside, and I'm striking on the inside line. This attack here can be a lot of things. It can be a punch, it can be a palm strike, it can be a tiger claw, it can be a finger jab. Um, but the principle is, when that punch comes at me, oh, I'm going here. Action. I'm gonna do the punch one. Doing it low is also a split entry, but we are gonna do that on the high line for now because we're gonna go into another stuff. We're gonna go into some other things. So let's go try it out. <laughs> We're back. Okay, so now we're going to practice that split entry during our fighter trainer drill. So when Emmy throws a straight punch at me, I'm going to parry on the outside and strike on the inside, trying hard not to hit Emmy in the face because she's way too pretty to get hit in the face. So we're moving around. We do that in motion because we want to get the timing down on that. Okay, so you can practice that. You can also just just practice the drill. If she had some boxing gloves on, uh, the way I kind of work this is, she's trying to tag me. Okay, and I'm just trying to get that timing down to those two things. So that's the basic, that is the principle we're doing. We're going to add on to that too and give you guys some other stuff to do. Okay, now after you get an interception, that's a time when it's actually a pretty good, uh, you'll have a pretty good chance to pull off some other things. So I'm going to give you this one thing, but it's not the only thing you can do from here. What I'm going to do is, it's almost like I'm doing a tie boxing clinch of her arm. I'm going to capture it, use that to take her down with kind of a half moon step, and then I'm going to step into the arm bar from there. Okay, so that's what this is going to look like in real slow motion. So Emmy throws the punch at me. I do my split entry. I'm going to capture her arm here, up tight against my body. Action. I don't want to just stand here because she would either headbutt me or punch me in the face, okay? So I want to use that momentum. In real life, it would be moving quick. But from here, boom, I capture, turn, take her down right away. I'm going to insert my foot, step across, and fall back into the arm bar, making my partner nearly blind at the same time. Oh, I mean, I just knocked her glasses off. That was important. And then from here, we do our arm bar, okay? Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> and cut.